All right, this is an isometric workout. I love isometrics. Isometrics pull in and incorporate a lot of muscle activation and are really, really, really effective. I do this routine all the time and uh, I just love it. It's very, very, very effective. So here's what we're going to do. Each hold that we do, you're going to do for uh, for 20 seconds, and then you're gonna rest 20 seconds and then move to the next one. And don't worry, when it comes to the, the workout video on this, you'll be able to watch and it will be timed to where it'll be very easy to do. You wanna be sitting down, okay? You can be sitting on a couch or in a chair or, or wherever, okay? So there are two things that you wanna focus on with isometrics. One is that you're really giving it all you've got, 100%. There's a tendency to just kind of feel like you're doing that, but you're not really maxing out, you know, for the full 20 seconds and really giving it all you've got. So that's okay. When you start out, if you haven't done isometrics before, it's gonna feel a little strange. And uh, in fact, I don't care if you just go through the motions for the few first few times you do this in order to get the feel of it and then gradually increase the effort side of it. The second one is breathing. You don't wanna hold your breath. Okay, so you wanna concentrate. The most effective way with breathing is mouth closed and just simply breathing through your nose and kind of exaggerating your breathing through or the second, second best is breathing, inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the mouth. And the third is inhaling through the mouth and exhaling through the mouth. So eat any one of those that you're most comfortable with, but make sure that, that you do that uh, while you're doing it, okay? So the first one is right here. You're gonna take your hands like this. You're gonna squeeze your hands as tight as you possibly can, trying to break your fingers, and at the same time, try to pull your hands apart. Now, sometimes you're, you're, you'll be pulling so hard, you'll kind of be shaking. So I put my hands right against my body to kind of prevent that from happening. And then, so you're gonna pull, okay, as hard as you can for that 20 seconds this way, all right? Then you're gonna rest for 20 seconds. Then you're gonna switch. So from here to here, same thing, up against your body. And then you're gonna pull as hard as you can for 20 seconds there, all right? Then you're gonna rest. Now this one, you're gonna put your hands together, grip your fingers, put it against your chest. And now you're gonna push as hard as you can Trying to break your wrists almost, just really contracting, okay, for the 20 seconds. With all of these, you'll feel it bringing in a lot of different muscles, chest, shoulder, back, arms, you'll, you'll really feel it, okay? So let's review to, to begin in sequence. First one's here, second one's here, third one's here. Now for the fourth one, you're gonna put one hand flat, the other hand make a fist. You're gonna put it in your hand. And now you're gonna push down. I'm trying to push this hand to the floor. And I'm trying to, with this hand, pull this hand up to almost hit myself in the chin, okay? So that's the, that's the motion. So you're here, okay? Again, giving it all you got, all right? Pulling up, pushing down for the count of 20. Then you're gonna rest for 20, and then you're gonna reverse it. This hand flat, this hand makes a fist. You're coming down and you're pulling up. We're gonna bring the, the legs into play along with still working the upper body. For this one, you're gonna take your, your, make a fist. You're gonna put it between your knees, okay? You're gonna try to crush your hands between your knees. Okay, so you're coming in this way and then you're gonna try with your fist to pull your legs apart, okay? And again, you're gonna feel it in your arms, you're gonna feel it in your legs. Hey, it's just a phenomenal exercise. So it's for 20 seconds, pulling apart, pushing, all right? Then you're gonna rest for 20 seconds. And the last one, the final one, is you take your hands to the side of your knees, you're gonna to try to push your knees together and at the same time, pull your knees apart. Okay, it's just bringing in some different muscles doing similar to what we just did. Okay, so it's here and I'm pushing as hard as I can, open hand against the knees on the outside. And then I, I'm fighting that by trying to pull my knees out. 